Crime is a central issue in the mayor's race, and the question of how dangerous Albuquerque is jumped forcefully into the spotlight today. At a debate, Mayor R.J. Berry claimed again the city is getting safer, which sparked a blunt, expletive-included response from one of his opponents. News 13's Alex Goldsmith is in the Newsplex. Alex? Dick, there's an old saying, there are lies, damned lies, and statistics. Well, when it comes to crime, the stats can tell two different tales. During closing statements at a forum held by commercial real estate group NAIOP, all three candidates made conflicting claims about the city's crime. The FBI crime rate in the last three years is the lowest FBI crime rate that the city has seen in the last 20 years. There are 650 less auto thefts last year than the year before I took over. Crime is up, and Mayor, the FBI says it's up. Rape is up. Property crime is up, as well as uh, auto theft. But Republican Paul Hay went a step Seriously. further. As a cop for 25 years and the mayor wants to tell, say that the crime rate is going down, ask a cop that works the streets. I have to call bull****, <laughs> mayor. I don't know any other way to say it. So who's really throwing bull? According to FBI statistics, from 2009 to 2012, the total number of violent crimes in Albuquerque did increase. But because the city's population also went up, the violent crime rate, crimes per person, fell about 2.5%. It's a similar story for property crime. Total property crime is up from 2009 to 2012, but again, the property crime rate is down about 2%. Now I reached Hay for comment tonight. He says he stands by what he said and how he said it, saying it's about time someone tells it like it is. Back to you. Okay, Alex, APD stats from the first six months of this year show the total number of violent crimes down 8%, while the total number of property crimes is up almost 4%. Just